Good morning, goat lovers. This is absolutely the coolest thing in the world. This is the Williamette River, like the headwaters, I guess, or, you know, way upstream. Man, it's neat. Boulders covered in moss. Of course, people were here. Let's climb back up to the truck here. So I didn't make it to where I wanted to last night. Um, I was coming up out of Creswell, Oregon, and I anyway, I found a spot, a pull-off, like right then and there that had a a decent view of a lake and had cell reception so I could so I could work. So that was I just stayed right there. Now we are going this way through the Williamette Forest. And there is snow-covered peaks up ahead. And it's just beautiful. Just beautiful. I've already fed our, well, I gave little Dreamer dough hay. She hadn't had her bottle yet. But whenever I find a, here in an hour or two, when we get to the other side of whatever this is, um, there'll be coffee. That was an oversight. There's no coffee out here, but there might be a little town up ahead to, to get to get a cup and anyway whenever i get a cup of coffee i'll give her 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 bottle and blah blah blah. we'll go from there places the, the video game the Oregon Trail this is what they were trying to get to you know here look at them pines We have made it to some town here with gas and McDonald's and coffee, so we are gonna get this doling her bottle. Oh, back in there, yeah. I know somebody would ask, like, why don't I get her out? Why don't I, you know, set her on the ground or something? Like, I, because I used to be a landscaper and everything is sprayed with Roundup glyphosate some sort of weed poison and I'm just you know this is I've already made a big expensive mistake um, so anyway that is why we don't do that we you know you can't just you know this is it's it's legally my goat until I deliver her but you know someone else is expecting her and they paid money for her and and I'm not gonna jeopardize that you know so she's fine in here um, no one's uh, trying to steal her no one's gonna run her over no one's trying to poison her <sighs> yeah drink it up girl you only got like 11 more hours or I don't even know how far it is 10 or 11 hours of driving plus stops one more day 
you'll be there tonight. And she's like running from me with it. Pretty girl. Some pretty blue eyes, huh? These towels, I know they look messy, but man, this goat is so clean compared to years previous. And to be honest, it does not stink anywhere near as bad as it has in years previous. You know, with the pine shavings and or any bedding like that, by now it'd almost be composting and just stink to high heaven. And like I've mentioned before, probably already, it's just kind of the worst case scenario to have to clean out the, the trailer somewhere. You know, no one wants to see you doing it, so the towels are definitely working better. All right, so the little doling is now bottle fed. She's got food, she's got water, she's good. I have now found coffee. And believe it or not, these two large coffees were only $3.38. So we are here in Oregon. I don't know why that's so dang blurry. And we have a, an 10 and a half hour drive to Salt Lake City. But like I mentioned, that's gonna take me like 13 hours at least. Um, so. We're off. In a quarter mile, turn right. Thank you. Well, hello again. All right, guys, I have made it back to Salt Lake City where I'm trying to clean up a mess that I made the other day. And finally, dropping off my last goat. All right, Dolly. Come here, girl, you made it. Oh, that's right, the trailer just doubled in size, huh? <laughs> so this this little doling here has traveled more than most humans. She started out in Arizona. She's been to Utah, Idaho, Montana, Washington State, Oregon, back to Idaho, and she is back in Salt Lake again. Come here, girl. I know. It's been a long ride, huh? So, I had mentioned the alley here was our 21st. We did the drawing. We drew, we drew the first 20 names out, and Allie was not one of them. But the whole time, she wanted this dreamer doling. And she, then we, you were the 21st name out, right? Or the, 21st. Yeah. So yep. we did the first 20, and then me and Crystal just spot, started pulling names out and calling. And Allie here had been paying attention the whole time on our website, monitoring who had been picked. And everybody picked Bucks for some reason. So when we called her, she was excited that she got her first pick, the Dreamer Doe. Yeah. And then for some reason, when I was, the Dreamer Doe and the Piper Doe look very, very similar. But I, I messed up and gave her the wrong doling. So here we are turned all the way back around 
bring her back. I've had a fun time traveling with you, but it's over now, okay? Yeah, so they'll, they'll still remember each other, <laughs> I'm too. I'm sure. I hope so. Oh, they will. Yes. Goodbye They're going to be like, home. you Goodbye again. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you, Allie. Thank you very much. All right. So I am now goatless. Finally. 800 miles later. Oh. It's uh, 10 o'clock here, Salt Lake time, I think nine something. It's a little after nine Arizona time, a little after 10 Salt Lake time. And I am, I am tired. I don't wanna drive in the heat tomorrow. It's like 110 in Phoenix and most of Arizona, but I'm not gonna, I'm tired. There's no way I'm gonna make it home. So I'm gonna sit in my truck, stare at my phone and try to find a, you know, a truck stop or something to sleep at. But, so I made a big mistake and I drove 800 miles to try to make it right and, uh, and she's happy. Um, I'm very lucky that the, the woman up in Montana was very understanding and very, um, just just awesome. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy that, you know, she got the lady up in Montana who wanted the Piper dough that I accidentally gave to Allie she got a full refund and Allie got a bonus goat for free and a companion for her dreamer doe and uh and uh you know and i had to drive 800 miles but i'm the one that made the mistake um you know so that that's where it, that's where it, that's kind of how that is you know so i messed up so i had to pay you know when you when you're in business for yourself we learn by uh research and trial by error and and when you make mistakes it's painful financially and sometimes physically and mentally and but but most of the time financially and this was a financial very painful financially for me but that's uh that's how you learn so i've learned won't do that again we're gonna end this video here we'll see you guys in the next one <laughs> hey everybody guess what I'm home. There's blue on top of the hill waiting for me. Made it, made it home. And uh, the sun's still up, whatever. Made it home in time to watch the last of the sunset. Supper's almost ready. Can help with the evening chores. It's been a long day, it's been a long ride. Um, only one big mistake. Hey, bumpers. Hey, Tiefers. Hey, Bobby. Oh, hi, buddy. Hey, Bobby. <laughs> He's happy to see me. There's a bunch of goats right there. It, like I said, just in time for chore time. So I'm going to try to stay away from them because they'll all start screaming. Thank you for riding along. Um, watching these videos. I know it's a little different content than... Oh, I don't know what I did there. Hopefully you can still see me. Thanks for riding along with me. I know it's a different type of content, but we'll work through it. But I am going to go give my uh, wife a hug and say hi to my kids, and I will talk to you all later.